So this is a complaint video. I am having a problem with the XP Pen Artist 22 HD. The problem is when I have a drawing program open, when I put my pen above the monitor, just slightly above, it tends to be all jittery. And that is a real problem when I'm trying to draw. So I'm going to just try to make a straight line. I'm not moving that pen. It's making these weird, what I can only describe as curly telephone cables. And that is not a good thing when I'm trying to draw. It seems to be smooth well, actually, I take that back. It's still curly when I increase the speed of my pen. And yep, that is a nuisance when drawing. I've tried several methods in order to correct it. Some people suggested uninstalling the driver, reinstalling the most updated one, reboot, tinkering around with the Photoshop grid and slices feature. I've also tried uh, changing the compatibility mode so that the program could run with Windows 8. Keep in mind there are no other drivers installed on my computer. I don't know what's make causing this, so Photoshop is not Im is not the only one immune to this problem. I have Manga Studio out. And as you can see, the same thing, well, you can see it better if I don't do it in the pencil tool, if I do it in the brush tool. Um, it'll be all jittery as well, which is not a good thing because I can't draw like this. I do it slightly faster. Um, just as bad, <laughs> if not worse. So if anyone has any problems to fix this, please uh, message or comment below for those who are thinking of buying an XP pen. Uh, I suggest try, um, you might save your money to buy a, a Wacom Cintiq or whatever the equivalent of your pen monitor is. I actually have a Wacom Intuos for myself and I've had it since 2009. Still no problems to this day, so if this problem doesn't resolve itself, then I'm just going to switch back to that. And also, you are not good customer support for XP Pen. You have not given me any solutions and now I cannot return this even though I've just had this product for a few months. So. Thanks for watching.